Yeah. Just your thoughts on, on the way practice went today and the uh, scrimmage aspect of it. I thought we had, uh, from an offensive standpoint, good tempo. Um, we were competing, you know, having some fun out here. Started off a little slow. Got to get that fixed. But, um, you know, it's always just good to get out of the first scrimmage and, you know, compete a little bit, like live tackling and stuff like that. Definitely some things to clean up. But, uh, you know, made some plays. Defense made some plays. When you look at quarterbacks, I mean, what are some of the different things you're seeing right now from those guys? Uh, Peyton, for sure, just experience running the offense. Um, you know, just seems very comfortable back there, which is nice. And the younger guys, uh, Nick and Mike, you know, they have a lot of talent. Just got to bring that experience along. Um, so just that will come with the more reps. The wide receiver room, it's uh, placed in the semi, and you know, Donovan's not participating right now. Who, who else is stepping up? Uh, Wop, for sure. Wop's stepping up. He has to. Uh, Chris Gajak. He's getting a lot of reps with the ones, which is nice to see. Um, he's a guy that's comfortable playing all positions. He's a smart guy. Uh, who else? Let's see. Um, we got that freshman Jacoby in here. You know, he's he's learning, so things things are moving so fast for him. Uh, but you can just see how much you know talent he has. So if we can just you know get him more comfortable, kind of like a uh, Mike Phoenix, then he'll be doing really well. How has your role changed? Or has it changed? It has. You know, um, just kind of just stepping up as a leader of the group. And I'm you know, really taking that serious. And also, I don't know if you guys saw, but I was playing some outside today. So um, I just think that I've gotten so many reps at playing at the slot that, you know, we don't have that many guys right now. And they're just trying to move me around, get me in different places. So kind of just getting comfortable there and um, just leading these guys. Do you have a preference on whether you're inside or out? No. You know, I think just – you know, a couple more practices, I'll feel right at home at that outside spot, but it's just, it's been a while since I've been out there, so. I mean, just... do you view yourself as a possession receiver, or do you view yourself as a guy who could get the home run ball? To? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I, you know, I can see why people would lab label me as a possession receiver from last year. Um, that was just kind of my role. You know, not a lot of deep routes are going to send me a lot on those, but um, this year, that'll definitely change. Moving to the outside, what changes for you? You know, just a lot of uh, press man coverage. So you got to work different releases. Um, and that's the biggest thing for me. I usually, you know, get the guy five yards, five yards off. So um, it's a little bit different. Just guy right up in your grill and just uh, making more competitive catches out there. You doing more of a feature thing. What was it like playing? You guys maybe wouldn't be interested in it. Uh, playing football in Texas. Wow. Uh, I, 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 I miss it. it. It's... It's intense. I mean, we had 10, 12,000 people at, to the least, you know, at our home games and stuff like that. It's just you kind of get used to playing on a big stage at a young age, which is good for, you know, guys going to the, the next level. But, um, I mean, they take it very serious there for sure. The, the passion to play in, in Texas, did, did that even help you when you had, you know, the transfer maybe uh, not playing as much now help, help you overcome some of that adversity? Yeah, absolutely. Um, just I learned a lot of things. Um, you know, playing that competitive ball down there that have definitely translated to the next level. And just the quality of play. Yeah. Down there too, other than that. Yeah, I mean, every week you're going against a guy that's committed to TCU, Texas, A&M, all those schools. So, um, you know, you learn to play with the best at an early age. How optimistic are you?